Hello everyone, it's me, Diamonds Knowledge. Welcome viewers, welcome Knowledge family, welcome subscribers. Um, it's that time, I'm going to take my time. I'm not going to be up here all day, I promise you that one. Um, hello. Um, so, hello Miss Nene, how are you doing? I do not plan on being up here all day at all. Like, I know it's Friday, and it's like, for, for you parents, you know, getting the kids in bed so you can get some quiet time for the week and uh, to just relax from the week and all that good stuff. So, um, as you can see in the title, let me talk about deals, deals, and more deals. I'm gonna run over some, I'm gonna run over some deals with you guys really quickly. It's not a long list. I'm just gonna go over some things that you guys can take advantage of. I'll um, continue to put stuff up that you guys can take advantage of throughout the holiday, because who doesn't like to save money and be able to purchase things for family and friends? And then as soon as I get enough people on, if they're not on. Today, I'm going to announce the winner. And how this announcement is really going to work is, is I'm going to announce the winner. <laughs> and the winner better hope they're on. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. The winner better hope they're on <laughs> to hear that they have won. So, hello, Broccoli. So, like, if they are not on to hear that they have won... There is no backup winners for this prizes. So, if they don't grace our beautiful presence with their presence to know that they have won, I'm going to send this stuff to Nini's house. And I'll keep half, and I'm going to send the other half to Nini. Like, I'm dead serious. I ain't playing with y'all. <laughs> like, I'm sending it to Nini's house. <laughs> All right. So, um... I did broccoli. I did say your name. I said your name, broccoli. Um, oh, look, look at that earring sparkling the light. Look at that. You see that? Y'all see that glistening? Y'all see the diamonds? This is is it shining for y'all? Like it's shining for me? Look at my diamonds, just a shining, making me look like I paid a million bucks for the earring. Look at look at that. Y'all see that? Ah! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm too much today. <laughs> I know, right? Like it's just like it's hitting, it's hitting it. It's popping the day boy. Them ears is popping. Look, I can't even stop looking at it. Look at look at look at that. It's just like, hey, hey, hey. look at that sun. Y'all can't handle that sun. Y'all better get y'all shades on. <laughs> oh, so okay. Okay, okay, okay. I had to make myself laugh because you know my mood, my mood, my mood is turned up. <laughs> like <laughs> turned up. I'm in that. I'm in that turned up mood. Okay, so let's go with some deals really quickly. I understand you're super excited, Miss Broccoli. I just can't stop looking at it. I understand you're super excited, Miss Broccoli. However, um, I'm going to give the um, winners a few more moments to come in to this live before they lose their prize. So, <laughs> I'm just going to give them a few moments. So, we're going to run over some deals. Like I said, I'm not going to keep y'all too long. It's Friday. I don't know about... um. <laughs> oh, I don't know about y'all, but my day has been a doozy. I've had a doozy of a day. <laughs> I felt like I'm in high school doing homework. Oh my gosh. Was the question that difficult? Was it that difficult? I mean, I thought it was a very simple question. Felt like writing a book. Oh, well, that's a good thing. I need to write a novel of my life. I'm telling you. Hey, it's what it is. So let's go over a couple of deals that are going on right quickly. So, you know, those who want to hear about these deals can definitely get it. Baby! Hey, baby boo! Hey, baby boo! He's going to come here running, y'all. 
When I when I say when I call him dead, he come here running. I need my lip stuff. My lips feel dry. My color don't got off. It's still a little still a little bit up there, but it's my lips feel dry. So if you guys did not know, Bath and Body Works has hello Carmen. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So Bath and Body Works has all their body washes and shower gels. For three dollars and ninety five cent for today only, so you have until midnight. It only, so you have until midnight. Three dollars and ninety five cent a bottle. If you know about Bath and Body Works, you know they typically range between twelve and fourteen fifty. They're three dollars and ninety five cent, and you want to use the code Fave Suds. So that's F A V E S U D S. It's on the website. So, those of you who love Bath and Body Works and um, love their shower gel or their body wash, they even got the aromatherapy um, body washes um, as well for uh, $3.95. So, um, definitely, 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 definitely go check it out. If you have females to buy for and you don't know what they want, it ain't nothing like some good Bath and Body Works to make them happy. All right, so it's three dollars and ninety five cents. They also got the buy three get two free as well. But if you like me, you hone in on that three dollars and ninety five cent. And so it's like uh, free shipping if you spend like forty something like that, forty forty five something like that. So look, you can get a lot of soaps with forty bucks. Just to let you know. I'm just telling you how to work it. And they still have um that sounds like a chip back up. No, that's my that's my lip my, my this is what goes in my purse. So you know how um you go somewhere and like your lips is popping and somebody else's lips are crusty and they be like, Oh, you got some Carmax or something. Um, no, but I do have individual applicators. That have never been used. You can stick inside of this, swab it around. You better make sure you get enough on that little applicator, cause you're not re-sticking it. And I hand it to you, and you fix your lips. That's how that works. But I'm sorry that it sounds like a chip bag, but it's not. It's all lip stuff. <laughs> you ought to see me with the kids, the little girls. Know their lips are dry, cause kids have dry lips all the time. I be taking that thing. I be swabbing the inside of the clear. <laughs> Pull it out. I'll be like, come here. And I'll be like, smear it <laughs> Let me fix your face. <laughs> but yeah, I love little applicators. I got to invest in some more. Hello, Mr. Toya. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. We were just talking about Bath and Body Works, which I know Mr. Toya loves. The shower gels and body washes are $3.95 using code Favorite Suds. You can see, or oh, Fave Subs. Suds, excuse me, you can see on the website. So definitely check that out. Now let's go, let's move along to a few more other deals. So just so we can make sure we get through these deals. I bet everyone's think saying the name of the I know everybody's thinking, say the name of I know, I know you all are. <laughs> That's why you're waiting. That is exactly why you guys are waiting. <laughs> I told look, Miss Carmen, you late, baby. I said, I'm going to make y'all wait a little bit. Y'all going to wait. Just, y'all going to wait. Y'all going to give me 15 minutes of y'all time before I announce the winner and y'all fall out. Okay? So, now, yeah, I know. I know. I can feel y'all excitement. Like, I'm just so happy for those who won. But I'm just trying to give all the winners time to come on this live. Because if you are a winner... And you are not on this live, you will lose your prize. Because I think I've said it like 700 times that the 16th was the day in which I would announce the prize. So today is the 16th. So, just like how y'all did trivia, and it was okay, let me let it be fair for everybody. Especially those, because we had some people come up at the end and started answering all the other trivia questions. Oh, yeah, Mr. Toya, Bath and Body Works, all the body washes and all the shower gels, including the aromatherapy ones, are $3.95. 
Now, if you buy Bath & Body Works, you know they range between $12 and $14.50. So, at $3.95, the sale ends tonight. It's a one-day only sale that ends at midnight. $3.95, all their body washes, all their shower gels. Okay? So, yeah. So, like I was saying, I told you guys. So, whoever was supposed to win the prize... If they have not came on this live, by the time I get to the prize, there is no backup person. Yes, you can buy it online. It's online, Miss Latoya. The savings is online. Yes, you can buy it online. As many as you want. So, um, if, the, if I'm trying to give them all time to come in. If they're not in, I, there's no backup person. There's literally just three people. Your video looks like you talk sinking, talk sinking. I don't know why it looks like that. Might be my um, might be my data. Hello, Miss Irene. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing good. So, if the winner is the winners are up here, and if they're not, they're just out of luck because there is no backup winner. Go out and come back in, Miss Carmen. I had to. Oh, okay, so it's not me, it's y'all. <laughs> what you saying, Nene? It's not me, it's y'all. <laughs> I'm good, Miss Nene. We miss you too, Miss Latoya. Okay, let's finish up. For all you ladies with babies, not quite sure how many of y'all it is, but you know, this video will be viewed in its future time. So, hey, there is a 12 pack of plum organics, just mango stage one pouches. Those are the, fr the fruit pouches for kids and babies. And so they are nine dollars and twenty nine cent, making it seventy seven cent a pouch. If you compare it to Walmart, who has a six pack for seven seventy six, being one twenty nine a box a pouch, you will see that Amazon saves you fifty two cent a pouch. So it's a twelve pack of Plum Organics Just Mango Stage One pouches. Are nine dollars and twenty nine cent, making it seventy seven cent a pouch. If you want to shop at Walmart, you will realize that that is a fifty two cent difference than what Walmart charges. So the cheaper place is Amazon right now for the Plum Organics Just Mango Stage One pouches. All right. In case you did not know, Best Buy has sixty percent off Beats by Dr. Dre. And that's their Your Beats 3 earphones. And so the deal is available online as well as in the stores. And it's, they're offering free shipping on any order until Christmas. So the, ear, the earphones or earbuds, as I call them, are $39.99. So those are Beats by Dr. Dre. Your Beats 3 earbuds. And this is at Best Buy. You can get it in the store or online, and they're only 40 bucks, And you get free shipping from Best Buy all the way up to Christmas Day. Okay? For people who are interested in a laundry detergent, all laundry detergent brand has a 134-pack of its laundry pods. It's the Almighty Pods. So, the price is $16.12, making it 12 cent a pack. So little pods, 12 cent. You're getting 134 of them for $16.12. Now Walmart normally sells it for $19.34. So you're saving by ordering it from Amazon. All right, guys? All right. And so next, anybody need any Clorox disinfecting bathroom spray? 30-ounce bottles are $3.48 on Amazon. They have a 30% off coupon, making the final price $2.44. That is Clorox Disinfectant Bathroom Cleaner Spray, 30-ounce, for $2.44 on Amazon. If you use Gang, like me, you're a Gang girl or guy, they have Gang Flings in Wash Scent Booster, on Amazon, this is the 20.1 ounce, and they have it for $9.96. It 
if you use Arm and Hammer and you have a cat. Arm and Hammer Multi Cat Clump and Seal Kitty Litter is on sale at Amazon and it's the 40 pound box or carton on sale for $19.74. Those of you who like to use Shout, Shout Triple Action Stain Remover, 60 ounce on Amazon is $3.75. Just gonna let you guys know. Shout Advanced Gel Ultra Gel Brush, 8.7 ounces. It's $2.23 on Amazon. Mrs. Myers. Guys, Mrs. Myers is expensive. I'm just going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to stop right there. Just in case any of you have the Grove subscription where you get the house cleaning products sent to your house every month, you get a new box. We're going to stop right there and honor Mrs. Myers and their, expensive, their expensiveness. However... Mrs. Meyer Multi Surface Cleaning Concentrate. Remember that keyword, concentrate. 32 ounce bottles. It's a two pack. It's $11.93. So you're getting 64 ounces of Multi Surface Cleaning Concentrate for $11.93. That can make a lot of bottles. Just want to let you know. Downy April Fresh Liquid Fabric Conditioner or Fabric Softener, however you want to say it. 103 ounce bottles are $6.47. That's $6.47 for Downy April Fresh Liquid Fabric Conditioner. 103 ounce bottles, okay? Let's go on to some dishes, all right? So Cascade Platinum Plus Dishwash Detergent, 70 count. This is for those who have dishwashers like me. I don't like to wash dishes, and hubby don't like to wash dishes, but he will wash dishes because the rule is if I cook, you clean. That's with anybody, like even with my nieces and nephews. If auntie's cooking, you cleaning. So don't ask auntie to cook nothing if you ain't prepared to clean the dishes. They don't. They don't learn now. They know the lesson. So they know when they when they say, "Will you cook?" I say, "Are you gonna clean?" They're like, "Yes, okay, I'll cook, but you washing dishes." For those of us who just just cannot stand to see our perfect model hands filled with suds and getting all ashy from the suds, like myself, I'm just teasing. <laughs> oh, the 70 count containers are $13.99 with Amazon, okay? Now we're back to some more downy liquid fabric softener. This is just a regular downy liquid fabric softener. 51 ounce, the 51 ounce bottles, in a two pack. Let me. I'm just. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna repeat that again. Okay. Downy liquid fabric softener, 51 ounce, in a two pack. So that's 102 ounces. Eight dollars and twenty one cent at Amazon. Guys, look at now. I ain't shutting no refrigerator. <laughs> All right. We look. Here we go again. Because, see, I'm a gang girl. So, when I see gang, I get super duper duper excited. Gang Liquid Original Fabric Softener. 41 ounce. Faux pack. 41 ounces. Faux pack. Y'all like that, right? 41 ounces. Faux pack. On Amazon, $13.88. That's four bottles of 41 ounce original Game liquid fabric softener. Thirteen eighty eight. Don't let me be the one to buy up all these deals and you have nothing to, to take a to wash your clothes with, or to take a bath. Don't get mad because I took up all the deals. Cause I will. Don't make me clear Amazon shelf. <laughs> all right, here we go with gain again. Y'all know I love my gain, gain, gain. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, Jesus. Woo. Gain dryer sheets in original scent. 120 count. $2.56. Cent. $2.56 for 120 count dryer sheets. Gain. Nene. No, ma'am. I need you to stay on this live. You can't go. <laughs> you got to let me get my order in first. <laughs> Don't you worry. I already ordered. <laughs> 
I done already ordered. Y'all think I'm telling y'all about deals I ain't ordered from already? I done already ordered. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Gain dryer sheets in original scent, 240 count, $6.49. That's 240 dryer sheets. Let's have your clothes smelling. <sighs> ah, gain amazing. <laughs> $6.49. Mr. Clean with Febreze Multi-Surface Cleaner. 40-ounce bottles, guys. 40-ounce bottles of Mr. Big Head Clean with Febreze Multi-Surface Cleaner. You want to hear the price? Here we go. $1.64. Yes, Mr. Clean with Febreze Multi-Surface Cleaner. 40-ounce. A dollar sixty-five on Amazon. Now here we go to this other brand. I don't care for this brand, but because I love you guys and would hate to be biased about certain ideas and certain solutions. Here we're in Thailand. Everybody, everybody, hold your pants because we're going to Thailand. Hate for the time to rip y'all away. Tide Pods Original Scent, eighty-one count. And, you know, Tide is always expensive. 81 count, $15.97. not going to spend too much time on, on Tide because you know I don't like Tide. I'm sorry. Tide Pods, free and gentle. 81 count, $15.97. It is a savings because if you know, the 81 count original Tide Pods is 20 bucks. Just Let's just put that out there. Now, they also have their detergent, not the pods. Or the detergent. They're 100 ounce bottles. I was raised on Fab and Trend. Yeah. Tide Original 100 ounce bottles. I was raised on Ultra. I ain't gonna tell no lie. It wasn't until I got a job and, you know, could afford to pay, buy what I wanted to buy that I became a gang girl. So I became a gang girl at 17. <laughs> like, I look, I literally, I'm not lying because I did all the clothes washing in our house. I literally walked to the laundromat with my little brother, carrying his clothes, some of my mama's clothes, all of my clothes, because, you know, he had to have clean clothes for school. And I literally used the Ultra Mama brought and gave for myself. My clothes didn't, I didn't wash my clothes with their clothes. My clothes didn't smell like their clothes. My clothes stay fresh for two weeks. Their clothes, that, that extra gain, that smell, that extra smell was gone like the next day. <laughs> Look, if you ever use extra, <laughs> the smell literally disappears like after it dries. There's no smell. There's no smell whatsoever. But I'm not knocking it. You long, The point is the clothes were clean. That's the point of the whole situation is get the go the clothes clean. That's the goal. Get the clothes clean. But when I became 17 and could buy my own, I was a gang girl. I knew what I wanted. Anyways, so you grew up on sun. See, everybody grew up on something cheap. <laughs> and don't even lie. Everybody mama was cheap. Don't even just don't even act like it. Don't act like y'all had it made. <laughs> but anyways, Tide Original Liquid Laundry Detergent in 100 ounce, $8.97 on Amazon. You heard correct. $8.97 for a hundred ounces of Tide. That is truly a savings. All right. Now, for you guys who like the ball. Drinks, which I love the coconut water. I'm so in love with every flavor of the coconut they have. They have five coconut flavors, and I go to BJ's just to buy them in the case because we love them here. Well, they came out with a new item, and it's the Ball Bubbles Sparkling Water Variety. They're 12-pack, which normally would cost you anywhere from $22 to $25 for a 12-pack. They're 12-pack. On Amazon is fourteen dollars and thirty six cent. Again, that is fourteen dollars and thirty six cent, making it a dollar and twenty cent a bottle. You literally pay three dollars in the Walmart convenience store for the ball, but you're getting the ball sparkling bubble sparkling water variety pack, twelve pack for fourteen thirty six. That's a dollar twenty cents a bottle. You have to know how to break this stuff up. Break this stuff up into dollars and cents of how much you're paying per ounce per item. That's how I buy. So, for you guys who still have kids, 
Honest Kids Apple Ever After, eight count juice boxes, two dollars and twenty four cent. If you know about Honest, Honest is an organic brand. So, Dove Men's Care Plus Fresh Body Soap, ten count. We're not talking about just one. We're talking about a ten count. And then we're going to take that 10 count and we're going to make it a two pack. So that's 20 bars of men's Dove. So y'all, that Dove men's care, have your man smelling right. I got some in this house right now. That and that men's Nevaeh, man, hubby be smelling yummy. I'm like, did you just get out the shower? He'd be like, yeah, what's wrong with you? Ooh, you smell so good. <laughs> he do. He be smelling right. But it's for, so you're getting a 10 count, two pack. It's $13.90. That's 70 cents a bar. What was the look? Ivory soap ain't even 70 cents a bar. Ivory soap used to be like you could get a three pack for like a dollar. But now Ivory done started filling itself. Filling itself. Ivory's like $2 for a bar of three. You're getting 70 cents a bar of Dove. Y'all know Dove is not cheap. It's not cheap at all. Dove is not cheap at all. 10 count, two packs, $13.90. Amazon. Now, for you hairy lady women, you know how the winter time come and you don't really want to shave your legs because you need the hair to keep your legs warm because it's cold outside. And in certain areas, especially up north, it's already snowing and you really already hating it. Gillette Venus Women's Sensitive Razors, six count, $9.32, making the $1.55 a razor. Yes. Don't skimp on your razors for your legs, ladies. Especially us late, not us ladies, because, well, I would take that back. Yes, us ladies. If I had a paddle that says, have you ever, <laughs> I have to raise my paddle up. Especially you, us ladies who like to do hair removal in other areas during the summertime <laughs> and the wintertime. Yeah. Oh, I can't do hard wax, Nene. Ooh, I got some. I got the little, I went, I got the little, the little container and the beads and slap it on. And you talking about somebody who screams. Hello. Welcome, Marissa. How are you doing? You talking about somebody who screams. They say hard racks is not supposed to hurt. That's a lie. That's a hot lie. Yeah. That, that, that's a hot lie. Whew. I still got some wax beads. You need me to send them to you? I got a whole pack of unopened tongue depressors. You want me to send them too? Matter of fact, you want me to send you the whole wax container? I'm going to throw the whole thing away. <laughs> I can't stand it. <laughs> but I try. I try. I really try. I just don't do it once and give up. I have continued to try to use it. I make the sugar wax. Doesn't hurt. Okay. Yeah. Sent Nene, I'm going to need you to text me that sugar wax recipe that don't hurt. Because <laughs> right now, um, I got some areas ah, that I'm afraid I'm afraid to let wax hit it right now. I'm just saying. And so, mm, let me just get my eyes right. Ooh, Jesus, I felt the pain. Ooh, I felt the pain. Mm. Yeah, me too, Miss Latoya. Who I felt the pain, like my light just flashed. So always ultra thin pad, size one, forty four count, three pack, thirteen forty one, making it four dollars and forty seven cent a pack. Um, next question. What's your next question, Miss Broccoli? Um, Happy Baby Organic Super Puffs, six packs or fifteen ten. Axe Phoenix Body Wash for your man. Here we go. Must be something about the men not smelling appropriately with Amazon to where they want to put the men's stuff on sale and not the women's stuff. But that's okay, Amazon. I understand. I will find a female deal, and I will announce the deal for the females. You can say whatever you want, Amazon. I hope you see this, okay? But here we go. Axe Phoenix Body Wash for Men. The 16-ounce bottles. 
It's a four pack. So you're getting four 16 ounce bottles. So do you know how much that is? That is a gallon. A gallon of men's body wash for $11.90. Do your math. 16 and 16 is 32. Wait, wait a minute. I didn't do my math. Hold on. Hold on. See how none of y'all caught that? See, I thought y'all were paying attention. Y'all too busy wanting me to announce the winners to even catch what I just said. It is a four-pack of 16, which is 64 ounces, guys. I need y'all to wake up. Y'all just want me to announce the winners for $11.94, making it $2.98 a bottle, which is still a big savings because that stuff is crazy. You making me want the shop so bad, I know. Mm. And then last one, because I, I know y'all waiting for the winner. Last one, Oral-B Glide Pro Health Deep Clean Mint Floss, six-pack, $10.84. I couldn't type fast enough. <laughs> I can get this for my brother and my dad, yeah. So definitely, if you're wanting to find out about this, Girl, I can't do math for good anyways. Look, I'm quick with it, Marissa. And so, I already knew what I was saying was wrong. But I said, let's see who go, who's with me. So, I, I said it and I said, let me see. Nobody called it. So, I went and came back and corrected myself. I'm, I love math. I'm quick with it. Especially when it comes to money. Honey. Honey. <laughs> Look, don't hand me no money and tell me to count. I'm fast. <laughs> but look, if you guys, Nene did speak to you, Keila. I mean, Broccoli. Nene did speak to you. I can stroll back and read to you where she spoke to you. Uh-huh. Don't let me don't let me go back up. I can tell you at the time in which she spoke to you. Broccoli. Don't make me do it. Don't I mean, I'm about to find it really quick. You said hello, Broccoli. She said she was good at 9.14 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. She did speak to you. <laughs> Look, I bring back the time on you. But listen, guys, if you want to find more online deals, I have told you guys, and I'll tell you guys again, you can find a lot of these deals on Crazy Coupon Lady, well, the Crazy Coupon Lady.com. Or using the Crazy Coupon Lady app. And again, if you don't want to use that app, you can, you can always go to Amazon, hit Grocery and Food, or hit that Prime Pantry. And it will show you all the things that are on sale and deals that Amazon are having. I was just naming a few. Just to kind of let you guys know, they actually have a lot of hair products on sale right now. Oh, excuse me. They actually have some ethnic care product care products on sale as well. I even saw a great deal on some Carol's daughter's products. It was like, well, this was earlier. So, one thing with Amazon, prices are subject to change at any time. So, when you see a deal, you need to jump on it. I saw some Carol's daughter shampoo and some Carol's daughter's conditioner. They were $1.60 a bottle for the 16-ounce bottles. So, hi, Genesis. So, you guys, definitely, definitely uh, check out Amazon. Like I said, prices are subject to change at any time. If you see something that's a deal, even if you, and this is with any website, guys. If you see something that's a massive deal and a massive discount, go ahead and order it. Because sometimes these are glitches and sometimes they're actual prices. And if it's a glitch... Most of the time, a store will honor a glitch. And if it's not, congratulations, you got a big savings. So, definitely, definitely, definitely do what you got to do. Oh, Gen oh Genesis, you just going to skip me? After I said, hello, Genesis, how are you? You just going to skip me, Genesis? Okay, don't type my name out. I don't need my name typed out. I know my name. Look at you. You type me everybody's name. That's okay, Genesis. I feel, I feel you. I hurt too. I hurt when you, are, no, don't give me the swivel love. Don't wrap me around the love hearts. 
all, you all, I'm the only one crying about love, Genesis. I'm the only one. <laughs> I love you too, Genesis. I'm just messing with Genesis. Me and Genesis, we be talking about stuff, so I'm just messing. You're leaving? Oh, Miss Broccoli, well, you have a good evening. You guys remember what I said? If you're not present when I go to name who the winners are, there is no backup winners. So, if you are going and you don't know if you're the winner or not, <laughs> I would hang on until she actually announces the winner. Because <laughs> I would hate for somebody to be the winner and they leave. And me and Nene get to split the prize. Because, boy, I tell you, that will be a good night. You talking about a fun time? Don't don't threaten me with a fun time. I would love to split this box up and send half over to Nene. Y'all threaten me with a good time. Y'all gonna just leave me? It's okay. It's okay. Y'all can threaten me with a good time. Threaten me with a good time. Look, I'm tell. Look. All right, guys. I think I made y'all wait. Have I made you guys wait long enough? So before I start, let's do roll call. <laughs> Cause I'm telling you, there's no backup winner. There is no backup winner. So if you are here, type your name and say here. <laughs> there is absolutely no backup winner. <laughs> and I honestly believe that one of the people names I'm about to call is not even in here. And if they're not in the chat room or on the live, they going to be upset. <laughs> Like, really upset. <laughs> Nene. I didn't say that, Genesis. I did not say that. I did not say that. Nene. I'm looking at the roll. Nene, you looking at this roll call? Nene. You see this roll call? I think I, I think what should we do? Cause um I'm not getting the I'm not getting one of the winners' names. The name not coming up on the roll call. Yeah, you looking? You not seeing them neither? Me neither. So what should we do, Miss Nene? We don't have a backup. <laughs> Keelan Pa said, "Can I remind someone? Who you gonna remind, Keelan Pa? You can remind whoever you want to remind." <laughs> <laughs> All right. Give it to you, Genesis. <laughs> we are. That's right. Thank you, Nene. We are the backups. <laughs> Unfortunately, I, we just did roll call. Dang it. I'm going to say it again. Roll call. You need to type your name and here if you are still on this live because according to the last roll call two of the three prize winners is not on live <laughs> so it went from one to two I'll give y'all a few moments while y'all doing that. What are we talking? So, um, I'm going to give y'all a chance. <laughs> Dang. It literally popped off. Um, so, <laughs> like, two of the three winners is not here. So, yeah. Nene, you got... Nene, text me probably what to do. Give me your input. Me, y'all, first I want everybody to say thank you to Miss Nene. She partnered up with me to help provide these boxes. These boxes were not cheap. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. She partnered with me to provide these for you guys. And I'm so thankful for it because, you know, I have a given heart. And she saw what and she wanted to join in and help. So I want everybody to say thank you to Miss Nene. She, her and Zach Pack helped create these for you guys. I want to first say that. Then I'm going to give you guys story time. To, uh, not story time. I'm going to give you guys a story that just happened today. And then hopefully I will do roll call again. And hopefully people will be in here. 
But Nene needs to text me on what we want to do as a backup. Because the way it's looking, it's looking like the people have stepped to the left. And see, when you step to the left, you be out of, you be out, you be out of pocket. You don't even know who won broccoli, so how can you say you did? Okay. Woo. I'm scared. Okay. So, I'm waiting on these. I'm going to tell y'all a story really quick, and then we'll go. Oh, you're fine, Rebecca. You're fine. So, the kids wanted to go out to eat. Hi, Carmen. I'm glad you're here. <laughs> I'm just teasing Carmen. I know you was here. So, um... The kids wanted to go eat Mikasitas. So it was my sister-in-law, me, and then my only nephew, and then the um the the um next to the youngest niece. So we go into Mikasita now. Mind you, I'm a big girl. My sister-in-law is a big girl. My nephew at the age of 13 is like 5'9. 230 pounds. He might face 240 because he's doing wrestling. So he just weighed himself. He's 240. But he's like 5'9. Right? So, and my niece, she's, you know, she's a chunky, about 88 pounds. She's a big girl. But she's not a big girl, but she's she's getting thick in the thighs and heavy in the butt area. However, she's not little. So, yeah, he's 5'9. Yeah. So, but he's like, he's 5'9", 240. So she said, do y'all want to boo for a table? So, of course, we say table. She come walking us up to this itty-bitty, look like it was set for two people table. So my sister, little, my sister she said, uh, can we sit somewhere else? Can we sit there at the bigger table? She was like, oh, that's for a bigger party. I said, ma'am, do I need to point out the fact that we're fat? And you about to sit us at this two-person table. We ain't going to be able to have no food sit on the table. Our elbows are going to be rubbing. And our bodies are going to be touching. <laughs> my sister-in-law. She, my sister-in-law is Caucasian. When I tell you her face went ghost white. My nephew said, oh my God, auntie. I can't believe you just told the lady that. I said, well, look, he said this while she's standing right there. I said, I'm sorry. I didn't know I needed to state the obvious. Like, it literally, I'm, I'm not making this up. They took a table that was designed for two people and put four chairs at it and thought us four people were going to sit there. Who was going to eat? I wasn't going to eat. Y'all already know I don't like for my food to touch. So that means when my food comes out, I got four plates surrounded around me. Because my food can't touch. So if I got four plates, and this is Mexican, you can imagine how many plates everybody else going to have at the table. Who's supposed to eat at that table? I said, I said, do, I said, do I need to really point this out to you? Do you not see what we look like? Do we look like we fit at this table? <laughs> my sister love. She was like, oh my gosh. Her, she literally went white. She went, when I, she was, she's already white. But she, when I say she went like ghost white, she was like, I can't believe you said that to that lady. Yes, I did. When we said that, I can't believe you said that. I said, look, sometimes people don't see the obvious. But now, here we go. Here's the kicker. She says, oh, we have some larger booths at the back. Y'all want to sit there? Yeah, that's fine. She walks us over to a booth where the table doesn't move. There's like this much space between the table and the seat. I said, who the heck supposed to sit here? Well, my sister-in-law sat down. She was hanging off the edge of the, of the seat. Half her, over half her body was on the, off the edge of the seat. I said, I ain't about to struggle to sit down and eat. I said, I'm going over there and sit. <laughs> Y'all can meet me over there. I literally went and found my own my own booth. Got in the booth, pushed the table where it needed to be. She don't come with her kids. She said, oh, much better. Exactly. <laughs> like, what do we look like? They had, look, Miss Broccoli, they had booths that were big enough to fit us, us four. But she wants to put us at the itty bitty, itty bitty baby booth that they claim is, is for a larger group. But everybody that can fit in that booth got to be a size two or less. Like my nephew, 
who ain't he, I mean, he's not even fat. He's solid. He's tall. He couldn't even fit down. He was like, God, this tight. You sit down. I ain't sitting down. <laughs> I went found my own table. <laughs> look, look, the lady, the hostess come back. We had to move the menus and the silverware and everything to a whole new section. No. She didn't she didn't use she didn't use none of her common sense. None. Like she like you could literally look at us and tell us and look and tell that that table was not gonna work and neither was that long booth. And that we needed a wider booth section. Like, come on, or a bigger table. Come on now. I mean, look, I love my nephew, but do I want to be bumping elbows when I'm eating? No. Miss Broccoli, that that booth from the seat to the booth was like this wide. <laughs> I kid you not. This wide. So my sister-in-law, she tried, she said, does the, does the table move? No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it doesn't move. <laughs> it can't. No, it, do, it can't move. We, no, we're not sitting here. That's not what we're doing. So, yeah, we wound up having a good meal. <laughs> However, I found my own table. <laughs> I found me a nice booth. They came on over. They was like, oh, yeah, this is better. Yeah, come sit down. Come join me because I'm not stupid. <laughs> Look, here's the thing about it, though. The first table had people on the left and the right side. My nephew goes, auntie, the people on the left side was just staring at us while you were talking. I said, and you would have been seeing their butt when they got up because that's how close they were to us. If anybody would have got up, out of their spot to leave, their butt would have touched our face. Literally like this right here. That's how close the butt would have been. Because the table was literally like, here's the booth. I'm My head's the table. Here's a big table full of people. So when they got about their seat, their butt would have been like this right here. Hello. <laughs> no. Not while I'm eating. I can't stand it. Look, I don't even want people to reach over my food. So <laughs> you think I want their butt in my food? No. <laughs> I want to enjoy my meal and not be seeing butt. All right, we did roll call. So, if I call your name, you are the winner. Are y'all ready? Wait, I don't feel like y'all ready. I don't think anybody's ready. Nene, nobody's ready. <laughs> nobody's ready, Nene. I don't think anybody's ready. Y'all don't want to know. <laughs> Y'all ready? <laughs> okay. Um, Mr. Toy is ready. <laughs> Nene, nobody's ready. Miss Rocky's about to cuss me out. <laughs> is anybody else ready? I'm seeing the numbers jump up and down of who's in the room or not. So I would really hate... <laughs> All right, let's get started. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? All ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Who's ready? I'm ready. Y'all ready? Hey, hey. Hello, Jose Lopez. How are you doing? Welcome. <laughs> we make Broccoli lose her religion. Yes. Okay, guys. Y'all ready? Say it one more time. Y'all ready? Y'all ain't ready. Who ready? Yes, welcome, Jose. How you doing, Mr. Lopez? Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, guys. I'm going to call somebody's name. This person is the winter. You so mean, you teasing us. I'm not teasing no one. I don't know what you're talking about. Baby, I'm thirsty. I can't, I can't tell y'all who wants I get something to drink. Don't y'all hate that? When your people got you on the edge of your seat, like who's sitting at the, who whose face is really in the screen, like saying already. <laughs> Baby, I'm thirsty. <laughs> I can't give them the prize until I get something to drink. <laughs> Well, welcome to YouTube, um, Mr. Lopez. All right. If I call your name, you are the winner of a $15 
Amazon gift card. Drum roll. Hold on, guys. Babo! Is he alive? I don't hear no noise. Mm. Yeah, I'm scared. When, he, when I don't hear no noise in the house, no book going, no computer talking, I'm scared. Ed! Ed! Yeah. Becky, bring me some water. <laughs> he was alive. <laughs> Baby, they want you to hurry up and bring me some water so I can tell them who won. They're getting angry. They've got smoke coming out of their ears and eyes. I don't have a cup over here. You just got me a cup out of the cabinet and some water, a glass. They got smoke coming out their ears, their nose, and their eyes. Miss Broccoli wanting to cuss me out. Miss uh, Miss Carmen, she about ready to bite my head off. Like if I was a bobblehead doll, my head would go too. <laughs> and Miss Carmen would have broke my neck. Yeah. What you say to that, baby? All right. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh. I'm sorry, Jose. We will not be listening to any music today. This is a music-free live. Everybody say it with me. It's a music-free live. We don't want no music. We don't want no music. We don't want no music. No music. No music. No music. No music. Girl, yes, Genesis. It's him. It's him. Ooh. I finally got my water, guys. Are y'all ready? Drum roll. The winner of the $15 Amazon gift card. Miss Nene said, wait, she got to go pee. Okay, well, Nene has to go to the bathroom. We got to wait on Nene. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry, Jose. Today is not the day for music. I greatly, greatly apologize. But, um, this is a, um, no music zone for today. I'm sorry that the cat scratched you. <laughs> not the throat, Nene. <laughs> Miss Carmen said she ain't saying nothing until I announce the winner. Miss Carmen just went. She just told me in her head. I hear Miss Carmen say, Cállate la boca. Yeah, she's telling me to shut up, y'all, until I announce the winner. <laughs> I hear it. I feel it. Okay, okay. The winner of the $15 Amazon gift card is. Wow. <laughs> I just feel like y'all I just feel like y'all holding your breath. <laughs> I do. Okay. So the winner of the $15 Amazon gift card is Miss Broccoli, none of your business. Congratulations. Miss Broccoli, none of your business. Please email me. Oh my hell oh gosh. Oh Lord. I, I can't even move along until I do this. I'm sorry, y'all. Uh, we had somebody come in that, you know, needed to go. Um, sorry. So, Miss Broccoli, none of your business. Congratulations. You do have to send me your address. Miss Broccoli, none of your business. You have exactly, exactly until 9 a.m., Tomorrow, that's 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, to email me. Keyword is email me. You want to email me at diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. This is diamondsknowledge at gmail.com with your address. Just to move the apostrophe between the N and the S. 
Diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. All right. So that was that was prize level number three. Who look, Jose and James and the other guy, they have all been block Angela. Like, I will keep blocking them all night. Okay. That's not the only winner. <laughs> Genesis said, why y'all congratulating her? She announced the winner. That was third place. All right. Time to say who went second place. I need a roll call. You need to put your name and put here. Because if that person is not here, I'm not telling who won second place. I need a roll. Roll call. Y'all know what? I tell y'all, dope man is like a dog in heat. <laughs> it's like, it's almost like, it's almost like he can't help himself. <laughs> I can't. I'm not starting tonight. I'm not laughing. I'm just looking. I see a lot. I did. I did. I blocked him. Don't worry. Every time you pop up, I'm going to block him. Then pretty much I'm going to flag his account. And so then when I flag his account, he's going to be in some real deep crap. He keep playing. I'm going to start flagging his account. I'm going to flag his account for the worst stuff. Uh-huh. And I'm going to report you. You just keep coming back, Jose. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to flag you for the most worst thing possible. Okay. Unfortunately, the second place winner is not here. So, I will have to talk to Miss Nene, who needs to send me a text message really quick. On should we pick somebody else? We'll, me and Nene going to converse through text messages really quick. And I'm going to let her decide who she uh, wants. I know you have other accounts. And, uh, yep, I'm going to hide you from my channel. And I'm going to report you. Let's say you're doing pornographic and sexually explicit material, sir. Thank you. Let's just give you that headline. <laughs> Miss Nene, I need you to text me, girl, on what we gonna, who we going to pick for the second place. The second place winner is not here. But I will announce the grand prize winner. Ooh, ooh. I wonder who won grand prize. Ooh, ooh. I wonder who won grand prize. Ooh, ooh. This winner of grand prize will receive the ultimate gift. They will receive a gift box, which I'm not going to tell y'all what's in it. But this person would be able to relax and enjoy themselves and have a wonderful time doing it. And the grand prize winner is... Coming to the stage! It's Carmen Camel! Woo! Carmen Caramel, you have until 9 a.m. <laughs> tomorrow morning <laughs> to email me your address. Again, 9 a.m. tomorrow morning to email me your address at diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. Just look at my screen name, remove the apostrophe, slap everything together, and add it at gmail. Congratulations. All right. Now, prize number two. It was meant to go to somebody else, but they're not here. So, I'm physically waiting for Nene to private message me on my cell phone. <laughs> Nene. <laughs> on who we should pick for number two. I feel really bad because I really wish the person was there. Was here. Yes, Miss Carmen, you won. Okay. 
You have to pick one, Nene. You ain't, you did not. You did not pick one. <laughs> y'all, y'all better start saying nice stuff to Nene. Like, Nene is, is picking the second place winner, which will receive the second biggest box. You guys need to be sending love and sweet things to Nene right now. She is literally... <laughs> Genesis put Genesis is here. <laughs> like, y'all need to be sending some love Nene's way because she's about to pick the person. Oh, my gosh. Broccoli, you already won. You can't win twice. He is a psychopath. He is. Guys, did I not tell y'all in the last live, that he got all 10K of his accounts fixated on me. <laughs> I ain't never seen nothing like it. I've never seen a man so desperate. <laughs> I've not. Oh, you read my mind. Okay, guys. Now, when I call out the winner, yes, when I call out the winner, of the second box. <laughs> Somebody better help Zach. When I call out the winner of the second box, you may direct all your upsetness to Nene. I'm just going to say the winner that she chose. <laughs> Nene partnered up with me and I'm glad I, first, I want to say thank you for everybody who did the trivia and um, who took the time to do it. There will be plenty, plenty, plenty more times um, for um, you guys to um, win trivia. We're going to play many more games, whether it's trivia, where it's, um, you know, drawings, for you know if you do a certain thing so there'll be many more opportunities for you to win please do not be upset as i said in yesterday's video we are doing the secret santa as long as we have enough people so if you are up here and you want to do secret santa um then i was i will say make sure you email me your address I will not share your address over YouTube. I will not hand your address over YouTube. It would only go to that one person who I have matched you with. So, if you would like to participate in that, email me your address at diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. We ain't see nothing, Genesis. I deleted it. We ain't see nothing. And so, make sure you guys send me your address, those who want to do it. And uh, if I don't get enough people, you ones who want to do it, don't you worry about it. Diamond's Knowledge got you covered. Okay? Okay? So don't you worry about it. If we don't get enough people, don't worry about it. I got you covered. You will, you will get a, you will be happy the month of December, at least one day. Okay? Is there a price limit? Yes. You can not spend more than $10. Cannot spend more than 10. 10 is the absolute max. That is 10, including um, tax. So that $10 includes your tax. So, um, yeah. Keep that in mind. So that means when you go to the store, your gift got to be $9.30 or less. <laughs> Okay, okay, I won't say that. Ten dollars is the max, not including tax. <laughs> tax does not count. Ten dollars is the max, not including tax. Okay, everybody got that? All right. So, um, <laughs> well, you, I'm sorry. I don't care if you unsubscribe, lick a cat's butt, find a dog's butt to sniff. 
I will remove you and report you every single time. You can unsubscribe a gazillion times. But we know who you are. <laughs> we are not stupid. There is not one person who is on this live that is dumb enough not to know who you are. So, you can unsubscribe, unsubscribe, whatever you want to do. But every time I see you pop in here, I'm going to pop you out. <laughs> That's how quick it's going to work. All right. So, there you go. You got a $10 limit. Okay? So, I know y'all wondering who's getting the second prize, right? Like, like, I just literally went, like, ghosted off that whole prize, right? Y'all want to know who Nene picked? Y'all ready? Drum roll! Prize number two, second place prize, is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful prize. And I really feel like, I know, <laughs> he is the copycat killer. You're right, Nene, he is the copycat killer. Second place prize, I do feel like it's, oh, who, Zach picked? Zach picked him? Okay. Everybody, please direct your hate to Zach when I make this announcement. <laughs> but I feel like this prize is really going to somebody who's going to really love it. Um, I've had an opportunity to um, get to know you guys very well. And get to know your personalities and the things y'all like. And it makes it, it gives me an honor and a privilege to, you know, be able to give Miss Broccoli an Amazon gift card, to be able to send Miss Carmen a box of things to help her um relax and enjoy life every chance she gets. And uh this next one, I think um it's going to a very, very special person. Um, she's a sweetheart. I have to say that. I know y'all I know y'all want me just to say the name already, right? She's a sweetheart and I think uh she's well deserving. Um and so I am pleased to announce that the winner wait a minute, roll call. <laughs> I got to make sure the person's here. I'm sorry. <laughs> Roll call. I've got to, I forgot to make sure the person need me pick this here. Because if they're not here, then, you know, you know, Broccoli here. Latoya here. <laughs> I, I do apologize that I'm making y'all do roll call. However, if the person has 86, like went to the left, I hate to say their name. Just bit out. I, I just bit out. <laughs> I'm sorry, Angela. <laughs> I yaga yeah, yeah, gotta do roll call. Because <laughs> I would hate to say the winner and they're not here. You have to be here to win it. <laughs> uh, we're, all right, I see one, two, three. I've seen five people. Nene made six. There's three more people up here who not answer roll call. Better hurry up for Miss Nene change her mind. Roll call. You last three. Let's see. I see Miss Angela. I don't see anybody else. Nene. You got to pick somebody else. She must have disappeared. I don't know. Where is Genesis? Genesis, where you at, girl? Jenny from the block. You used to have a little. Now you have a lot. But you about to lose a lot. If you... Thank you. Second place winner goes to Genesis, who just almost missed it. Genesis, congratulations. You are the winner of the second box. Genesis, you literally almost missed it, boo. <laughs> I hollered roll call. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I hollered roll call. And you didn't you didn't say yeah. <laughs> you almost missed it, boo. You was in the bathroom. You better be glad your pee was short. <laughs> so, Genesis, 
You are a winner. You are the, se- are the winner of the second box. She had to pee where her pee almost made her miss out. <laughs> Literally, Genesis. Everybody said, where's Genesis? <laughs> Genesis, you are heavily loved, honey. Everybody was like, where's Genesis? <laughs> yes, Genesis. You have until 9 a.m. tomorrow. To email me at diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. I know you here. You here, Genesis. We got you. You're the winner of the second box. I hope you enjoy it. I kind of feel like you will. Like I, 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 like, I, I talk to you a lot, so I kind of feel like you will. You guys, Genesis was selected by Mr. Zach. Everybody said, thank you, Mr. Zach. He selected Genesis. Okay. So, there are always going to be drawings. There are always going to be ways to win prizes. But like I said, if you want to be part of the Secret Santa, definitely email me your address. And, and put in the subject line, Secret Santa. Okay? That way, I'll know, it's, you, know you guys want to be part of Secret Santa. And you're not the drawing. Now, for the drawing winners, in the subject line, you need to put drawing winner. Okay? So those were our two winners. Now, um, should I tell you who the second person was supposed to be originally, or should I keep that to myself? What do you think, Nene? Should I out the person who would have won if they would have been on live? You let me know, Miss Nene. Nene's going to decide if we should out that person. No, spill it. <laughs> well, Miss An- Miss Angela, definitely email me so that we can be part of it. Okay. So these were the orders of our winner. First prize winner was Carmen Caramel. Second prize winner was Nisha S. But Nisha ain't up here. And third place winner was Broccoli None of Your Business. Those were the winners. I spilled the beans. Miss Karma, don't you worry. I know that's not you. I'm reporting them right now. All right. He's gone. Yes, those were our original three winners. I thank you all for participating in the drawing, doing the trivia, um, being a part of it, and um, just taking the time to want to have fun. Like I said, I have a special gift for all of you who do email me already. I do. I love you guys so much. I just I just cared about everybody. So, Miss Miss Carmen, I have blocked them and reported them, honey. I got you covered. I did it. I told you, Miss Carmen, I got you. I saw them and I got them. And I've 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 blocked them and reported him. Don't you worry. Okay. You can email me your address whenever you want to, Genesis, but it better be before 9 a.m. tomorrow. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> you have to email it, Jenny. Email. I have to make it fair because I've given out the email address, so you have to email me. Let's Let's remove you. Let's... Hide you from this channel. And let's report you. He must love to be reported. Like, I mean. Mm. Is it, if this crazy snob don't fly a kite somewhere. Look, guys. I have n- <laughs> please, 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 please. Guys, y'all gonna make me laugh, and I'm not gonna make it through the night. I have, I have never seen a man so attached to this channel <laughs> that he creates hundreds of profiles to come back in. Like that's I like and I'm not even scared. 
Because you guys, y'all know I stay packing. So I'm not even scared. See, what he don't understand is I'm about that life. When I leave my house, I have my gun. When I'm sitting in my house, I have my gun. I have two guns. One goes with me everywhere. One sits in the house. <laughs> and if I can't get you with that gun, I have an aluminum baseball flashlight that will beat the snot out of somebody. And then on top of that, I have a flashlight that has spikes at the end of it. So if my shooting you don't help you, if my beating you down with a bat don't help you, I will stab the F out of you <laughs> with my flashlight. So I'm not playing. So... Let them keep going. <laughs> That's what I'm just saying. I'm not scared. I'm not at the least bit scared. I'm ready. Look, I don't know what his life means to him. But <laughs> I'm ready to use my gun on somebody. It's what time. Let me shoot one human being. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. I would never shoot nobody unless I had to. How can I email you? Well, my email address is actually my name. Just remove the apostrophe between the N and the S. And I'll push, smush it all together and put at gmail.com. So it's diamondsknowledge at gmail.com. That's D-Y-M-O-N-S-K-N-O-W-L-E-D-G-E at gmail.com. So I'm be looking for you guys to send this because... Next week is when I'm going to start letting the people know. So I'm going to wait until the day, I'm going to wait today before Thanksgiving, which is Wednesday, to uh, let you ladies and gentlemen know who drew whose name. Uh, the code is on the website, but in case you need it, it's capital F, capital A, capital V, capital E. Capital S, capital U, capital D, capital S. Fave Suds. It's on the website. You have until midnight to get Bath and Body Works, um, all their bath wash and shower gels. You know, they normally run between $12 and $14.50 for um, $3.95. Jenny, Genesis, we know you're here. <laughs> Y'all, Genesis is excited. I think Genesis is super excited to know that she's won because she cannot stop giggling. She's super excited. She has to be. But I think I think I think that second box type of box it is is going to the right person. So definitely, I look forward to seeing y'all emails so that I can add you guys to the list. And um. You guys, even if we don't get enough, so look for the Wednesday video. That'll be the Wednesday before Thanksgiving. Look for that video. Hi, thank you, Miss Angela. I got it. That is that really broccoli? <laughs> is who really broccoli? <laughs> nay, nay, you about to start trouble. <laughs> um. Thank you, Miss Rebecca. I appreciate it. Um, so, I want you guys to know, Wednesday, when I go live Wednesday, right before Thanksgiving, because we got to find something to be thankful for. When I go live Wednesday, if you hear me say, hey, please be on the lookout for the emails. You know what? Sometimes they come faster. Sometimes they come later. Yes, I saw it, Miss Angela. I saw your email. Now, sometimes it comes faster. Sometimes it comes later. It just it just high depends on. Because sometimes what freezes y'all um, chat message up is when I have to report fools. And so, look at that bling, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at, look at that. Look at that. Ooh, boy. Look at that shine. Ah, baby. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm popping my own face. <laughs> so... Um, I want you guys, so if you hear me mention Secret Santa is definitely on on Wednesday. That means that that night when I come off the live, please don't be alarmed if you get an email at 11, 12 at night. That is me emailing you who your person is. A lot of times for our new subscribers, our new people, 
who don't know, a lot of times um, the Knowledge family likes to keep me on live for like two, three hours. So it makes me get off like at like 10, 11 o'clock, sometimes 12. So as soon if you hear me say, Secret Santa is on, then expect an email if you sent in yours. If you don't hear me mention it before Thanksgiving, just know I got you, boo. I got you. At least one day, in, well, one day in December, you go smile. Okay? Also, is that all the draws? Yes, Miss Broccoli. So, what's the picture of the prizes? No, Miss Broccoli. You cannot find out what the. I'm tr so true, I'm guilty. <laughs> you cannot find out what the prizes are until I get confirmation that the people have received their gift. So, Miss Broccoli, you need to email me because your prize can be e sent, which means I can send you an e gift card. You don't have to wait for me to mail anything. You wonderful other ladies, Miss Carmen and Miss Genesis, you guys got to send me your address. You have until 9 a.m. After 9 a.m., your prize will be delivered to somebody else's house. Okay? Guess what, y'all? My birthday is December the 4th. I have to work, so you can go. So can you go live on the day? You have to work on December 4th? Mm. I pray it ain't a weekend because I have a, a baby whose birthday is around that time, and she's going to be hot as fish grease <laughs> if I'm not around. Let's see. Okay, you good. That's Tuesday. Yeah, I can go live on Tuesday. Are you gonna? You have to work. Miss Angela, if you if you have to work, will you be able to watch? It would be good to go on that Tuesday to try to let you guys know some savings. I hope you guys have been getting your coupons to try to save where you can. If, if what I'm gonna probably be doing while I'm talking to y'all is my book gonna be in here scooping out the innards of sweet potatoes. To make a sweet potato uh, souffle. Diamond, I forgot to text and email back. I know you don't love me, Genesis. I know you don't love me. I know you didn't love me. I didn't need you to let everybody know you don't love me. You're right. My job is great. I can be on YouTube. <laughs> I know. That's a good job. <laughs> uh, can we do a book club? You guys want to do a book club? I have one person that wants to do um, Bible study. How you guys feel about that? Let me know. And um, y'all want to do book club? We can do. I tell you, I have Zoom for you guys. So if you ever want to do something like that, we can do a book club. Right now, everybody's wanting the Michelle Obama book, and it's available on Audible right now. If you like Audible, it's available on Audible, as well as if you've never used Audible before. Audible has um, a free book thing they do where like, you can get a month free. And you can see if Michelle Obama's book is listed as one of the books you can get for free through Audible. Because apparently through Audible, any book you choose in that first 60 days, you can give you like two credits, which covers two books, will let you um, pick any book. So... You guys who've never done an Audible trial, do an Audible trial and see if Michelle Obama's book is there. That way, you can not only have her book, even after your trial is over with, but you can also listen to her read it to you. Ooh, who would like that? I don't trust y'all right now. <laughs> that psycho got my nerves. Nitty. <laughs> You was wrong. Rocky said, I'm not going to be ungrateful. I'm thankful. Please say that again. Say what again? Miss Nene, my daughter's birthday is January. And hers is 19. Say what again, Miss Rockley? Um, yes, um, some people want to do a Bible study. If you want to do that, that's fine. I, if we do a Bible study through Zoom, I want everybody to understand. You can cancel the subscription. Yes, you can. It's 30 days. Can you make a sweet potato pie using yams? Yes, I hope so. 
Miss Carmen, is that you? Miss Carmen, because you're a little bit older than us now. You should know how to know that you can make a sweet potato pie using yams. Carmen, have you been taken over? <laughs> Has Carmen been taken over? <laughs> Carmen, let us know that it's you, baby. Put your age in the box so we know. We know that it's you because I know how old Miss Carmen is. And so, Miss Carmen, put your age in the box so we can know it's you. Because if the right age don't pop up, we going to know that it ain't Carmen, y'all. We're going to know it's not Carmen. <laughs> y'all, wait a minute now. We got to hold up. No, no, wait, no, no, I'm sorry, Miss Nene. Mm -mm. January babies do not rock. It's them February babies, huh? It's the February us Aquarius. We are the best. Not only. <laughs> No, no, no. April babies do not rock. January babies, they don't rock. December babies don't rock neither. Neither does March, May, June, July, August, September, October, November. The only set of babies that rock are February. <laughs> February. February babies are the best. Look, February, Black History Month. Boom. February, shortest month of all the months. Boom. February, Valentine's Day. Baby making day. Love day. Ha, look at look at what February got. February February is okay. <laughs> yes. But the rest of y'all, wherever y'all born, <laughs> I don't feel bad for y'all. If you ain't an Aquarius, if you ain't no February baby, mm, 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 I just don't know. Yes, it's really me. I'm the one who told you about one guy. He had gone me and it was over with. <laughs> okay, Carmen. We just making sure it's you, honey. Uh, <laughs> Carmen. Carmen. Just just to make sure <laughs> No, nah, Carmen, we not saying 48 or over. You cause that could be any number. Carmen, just to make sure it's you. Give us a snippet of your first time. What happened? Give us a small sample of what happened during your first time. That's the only way we're gonna know is you, Carmen. <laughs> Your answer's a suspect. It's me. I told you I'm from Ohio. <laughs> Carl, we just messing with you, baby. We just messing with you. We just messing with you. I expect your email, Carmen. <laughs> now, you guys, if y'all forget to email me by 9 a.m., your gift gets ghosted. 9 a.m. You have until 9 a.m. Or your gift gets ghosted. You've been ghosted before? Imagine your gift getting ghosted. Yeah. These are some really nice, these are some really nice gifts, you know? Show a picture, Carmen. <laughs> it, look, they can copy anybody's picture. Here's a game to do that. I will know if it's Carmen if I get an email. That's how I'll know. <laughs> All right, guys. Is everybody have a wonderful day? But anyways, I said we could do Bible study if you guys want to do that. No biggie. I just want the full understanding that everybody knows that um, they have to respect um, each other's religious beliefs and um, be understanding and open mind. So, and then we could do a book club. If y'all people want to go do an audible trial and get y'all, what's the name? Listen. We need to do a girls' night every Friday. This is so much fun. You know, we could do a girls' night on Friday. Let's do it like a Thursday so that we can do it like through Zoom. Um, that way we don't have to worry about um that boy coming showing his face up every chance we get. I'm sorry, y'all. My lips is getting dry. 
And I'm about to be beautiful. You're in? All right, Miss Atoya. We'll pick a day. What is Zoom? Zoom is a meeting platform. Uh, you can download it on your phone, computer, or tablet. I will give you the meeting code and let you know what the meet when the meeting is. And you just go to that um, application, put in the meeting code, and you're welcome to the meeting. You can go into settings and turn on your audio for your phone or your tablet. And um, you can do picture so that we can... Psycho won't let us be great in here exactly. And you can do your picture or you can choose not to. The guy asked me when my first made love did... I said, oh yeah, that's Carmen. That's the real Carmen. <laughs> Welcome, Carmen. <laughs> Sorry. We had to make sure it was you, girl. I know y'all. I know y'all asking me, why am I putting on lipstick if I'm going to be going to bed soon? Y'all, I literally wake up with lipstick on. <laughs> I literally wake up with lipstick on sometimes. I do. I hope it be like... Babe, I'll kiss him in the morning. He be like, babe, you do know you still have lipstick to go. <laughs> yep. <laughs> mm. But, uh, yeah, we have a massive, we have a troll infestation. Um, it reminds me of the movie Trolls. But we have a troll. I just can't get over this, my earring. Yes, we did. Everyone should know that's my real name because I'm polite. Yes, Carmen, you are very polite. We, I, It's like I knew it was you, but I just had to make sure that I deleted the right profile. Yeah. It's, you know, Angela, this, this is how we work. Um, Well, this is how I work. People can come in to my lives. They can subscribe. They can be a part of the Knowledge Family. You will remain a part of the knowledge family as long as you're not spilling hate. You're not, you don't, you don't have no vindictive or hate agenda. You're not being disrespectful to other people's beliefs, race, um, sexual orientation, disability. You know, we, you know, we joke about stuff, but on, on seriousness, if you just like blatantly, just being very disrespectful, um, very crazy, like very erratic, very stupid. I will block you. But other than that, you you are free to come in and join on our lives and talk. We are really nice people. We are really not mean. We're not. Nobody is mean. Everybody is very sweet and caring. But we do have a troll. And this troll has 10K accounts, so he says. And so some lives, we have to deal with him coming in and out for like an hour until he gets the hint that, okay, that's enough for today. And then he'll move along. And then we'll spend the next two hours just having a blast. But, you know, you still have to, you know, I watch your videos, but I never get your lives. Don't disrespect anyone. Yeah, and see, Miss Angela, we have a person one time that came in that was disrespectful to Jews, and I went off. I, there's a live where I just literally was talking to you guys and then went off because I was like, no, we're not doing that here because we don't do that. That's not what we do, you know. It's, we are very sweet. We welcome people into our family. It doesn't matter, you know, saying who you are, what your lifestyle is, or whatever. We welcome people into our family. You're know, welcome to be part of the Knowledge Family. We don't have any problems. We are very, very sweet people. However, I'm also very real. I'm very honest. I'm very genuine and very polite. But I am very politely reckless with the lips if I have to be. So, you know, it's all love up in here until somebody cuts the monkey. Then I have to cut the monkey, but I go right back to being sweet. That's the good thing about me. I can cut the monkey, 
but I can go right back to being sweet just a bit right there, you know. So, we are very sweet here. We love to talk. We talk about, and we talk about personal things. We talk about things that are not personal. We laugh. We giggle. They, they'll get in here, Miss Angela, and they will have me. You don't have to change your name, Carmen, because once I block him, and what happens is, is the way I block him when he comes in, it makes YouTube, um, makes him um, lose his name. So, Miss Carmen, you don't have to change your name. You don't have to change your name at all. Because it makes him lose his name. So, like, he's tried to copy my name twice. But he's had to put commas and spaces in between my names to do it. But once I report his behind, he loses his name. So, you don't have to change your name. You're good, Carmen. I know it's you. I was just teasing with you. We know you, Carmen Carmel. Please don't change your name. <laughs> we are a family. We act like a family. We talk like a family. Um, you know, we, we we are truly a family. And that's how we're the knowledge family and we stick together. <laughs> that being said, we will we will jump on somebody real quick. So uh if they come talking stupid, it scared me. You're fine, Broccoli. He never used my name. You know what? Well, he just tries. He just tries to go for what he rem he remembers. And he knows there's no way in this world there could be another Nene. Like, there can be another Nene. He did try to use Brown. He used Brown. But he put Derek as his first name. You can't use Nene. That's number one Nene. That's one Nene. It's only one Nene in life. Ooh. Only one Nene in life. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> guys, <laughs> I know you guys. I said I was never coming back because of that. Miss Broccoli, look, why would... Okay, so I understand. I understand, you guys, that when he comes and he does what he does, you know, I don't want you guys to be afraid because he, he cannot find any of you guys. There's only one Nene in life. Ooh. Only one Nene in life. Oh. Only one Nene in life. Ooh. Only one Nene. You happy, Nene? <laughs> Y'all don't have to be afraid because they cannot find you. Um, if you don't have an actual channel, they can't subscribe to you. Um, they can't see any of your information. Even if you did have a channel, they still can't see any of your information. So, you know, I want to sue the one guy for discrimination of character. Yes. Don't worry. I know how to cut him with an axe. I know there's only one of y'all. There's only one broccoli. I believe I subscribed was when I heard you talking about BSO, um, black seed oil. I wanted to keep up with it, and that's why I've been tuning in again and again. You're so funny. I've been laughing at you so hard. Well, thank you. I'm glad you can laugh. It's nice to have you with us, Angela. Yes, Angela, it's nice to have you with us, and Rebecca, too. Guys, y'all know what? I know y'all all who y'all are, because we got Jenny from the block, and then we got... Baby, you better call Spectrum because my live went down for like 30 seconds. Are you guys, can y'all hear me? My live went down for 30 seconds. I paid too much for internet for my live to go down for 30 seconds. Like it literally like stalled out for like 30 seconds. I thought he made a YouTube with his name being James Brown. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Only if he stole James Brown voice, it skipped and came back. Okay, I'm about to say, Spectrum about to pay. Look, I called Spectrum one day, y'all, because my internet was down for a whole entire day. I made them give me an account credit. <laughs> I did, I said, I said, I work from home. I did, I said, I said, I work from home. 
<laughs> and I didn't have an internet this that overtired day. And they gave me an account credit for a day of internet. <laughs> 30 bucks. They did. They gave me account credit of 30 bucks. I was not playing. <laughs> oh no, not to sing it again. Look. That should that should be the song Zach sings the Nene. Only one Nene in life. I don't think I don't think that's the song he sings. <laughs> I think he says, hands up, knees low, trampoline booty. <laughs> hands up, knees low, drop drop the booty, tra trampoline booty, <laughs> trap. Drop, drop the booty, tra trampoline booty, <laughs> trampoline booty, hands up, knees low. <laughs> I'm not going to see what goes in between that. <laughs> I'm sure that's what Zach says. <laughs> I'm just teasing, Miss D.D. Why are y'all taking that? See what I'm talking about, son? <laughs> Genesis got it. That little boy looked like a kid. His voice sounded like a grown man. Yes. Oh, y'all. Yeah. I look. I just got. I just got up to twerk. <laughs> Hands up, knees low. <laughs> Drop that booty. <laughs> Drop that booty. <laughs> uh, you almost caught your daughter, did he? Oh, thank you. I thought you were just going to start singing this song again, baby. Why don't you just meet me in the... I lost my mind for a little... So why don't you just meet me in the... Oh, in the bedroom, bedroom. And girl, don't you be late. <laughs> There's a meeting. <laughs> I saw your live flicker. I thought the world was in the girl. What? Whew. We can't have my live cock out before that I can say goodnight to everybody. No. Thank you, Carmen. I'm glad you can hear me. It's like It must be feeding slow for you guys. Like y'all probably hearing me like five minutes after I say something. But I need some water. Are y'all hearing me right now? I'm going to say a word, and whoever can type back the word to me in less than a minute, go. The word is go. Oh my God, there's a lag. Oh, uh, you almost caught your baby Nene. Thank you, Genesis. Okay, so y'all like a 30 second. Y'all right there. Genesis put go. <laughs> she actually typed go. Everybody put go. 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 This how this how I'm gonna look on Wednesday when I'm stirring <laughs> the sweet potatoes. I'm like right here. <laughs> oh yes. I like that name too. Little Nyla. Uh, one of my um, nieces played with a girl whose name was Nyla. I want peanut butter fudge so bad. Do you want regular peanut butter fudge? Or would you like some edibles inside that peanut butter fudge? <laughs> no, 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 no. I, it's going faster than that. Baby, why don't you just meet me in the middle? I'm losing my mind just a little. So why don't you meet me in the middle? Let me find the song. What's the title of the song? Edibles. Genesis, look at this. Just some edibles. <laughs> yes, Genesis, I said edibles. <laughs> tell, me, tell me the song again. Let me see if I can find the song. Woo, if I know the song, I'll sing along. Like a rhinestone cowboy. You don't know the title? Okay. Nene, what's the title?
Y'all, I know the perfect song that will be sung to Nene by Zach. I'm going to sing it to you guys. Um, can you play Imagine Me? I can't play it, Genesis, because I'll get copyright infringement. Yeah. That's not the song. And never would have made it. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I'm about to sing the song for you guys. But I got to make sure I don't play the song. I know, but the problem is it's copyright infringement. With So this is how YouTube works. So, um, you're allowed. So, uh, well, the time has come for me to say goodnight. I have to get up and go to work. Have a good night, Carmen. Congratulations. So this is how YouTube works. So for every time you have... Um, a copyrighted song, you can or cannot, upon their reviewing, be what's deemed for what's called copyright infringement. Even if you put, um, I don't own rights to the song, what they have, they have this, this, this slant face, this smiley face, this slant face, um, this angry face, and then this real angry face. So whenever you get to the real angry face, they will, well, when they get to slant face, they'll email you and be like, look, you have copyrighted material, you know, you need to uh, make this adjustment to now, blah, 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 blah. Good night, Miss Carmen. And so, um, then if you get that slant face, you get what's called, um, your account about to be shut down warning. And so, and then when you get, um, that angry face, you can lose your account and your account will be locked. Yeah. So, yeah, that's the only thing about it. Yep, that's why I try not to play copyrighted music because I do not have time for that. The song I gave you was wrong. What was the song? What was the song? Tell me what the song was. I'm trying to find the song for Nene and Zach. I'm trying to find it. Yes, it does suck, Miss Latoya. But some people would do, you know, do those type of channels. You know. And they'll have music up there. But trust and believe they they, they are getting hit with that, that stuff on the back end. I try not to get hit with that. Because I would hate not to be able to um, talk to you guys. So I'm trying to find um, the song for um, Nene and Zach, but I'll just um, I'll sing a part of, it and hopefully you guys um can sing can, can know what I'm talking about what I'm talking about. I just literally just lost it, like I literally lost the lyrics to the song, so I'm gonna find it. <laughs> Me too. Um. So, I need your help. So, I need your help. Okay. What's up, Mr. Toya? Okay. While Mr. Toya is typing that, here go the song. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll be, baby, it'll be all right. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll be, baby, it'll be all right. And the song goes, uh, hold on. Baby, go on ahead and relax. Kick your pretty little feet on the dash. We don't need to go nowhere fast. Let's enjoy right here where we're at. Who knows where this road is supposed to leave? It's just a matter of time. As long as you're right here next to me, it'll be all right. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll be, baby, it'll be all right. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll be, baby, it'll be alright. Cause I'm stronger, 
Strong and <laughs> okay, I'll go I'm done, 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 done. <laughs> So why don't you just meet me in the middle? Well, I'm writing a book. I wrote some pages. I need feedback. Oh, so, oh yeah, you were supposed to read it to us. You can write. I don't own copy to You can write it. However, you can only write it but so many times before you're flagged. That's the problem. That's my song. Yes. That's my song. Then my other one. Like a rain, the sun, the morning, let's be sweet. All up in the bed with you. Hold on. Still the kisses on the cover, babe. I see forever when I see your face. You make me who I want to be. You make it easy loving up on you. Make it easy whatever little thing you do. You're my sunshine in the darkest days. Seven, something, something, my saving grace. You make me who I need to be. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm just I'm done with y'all. I'm done. I'm not singing for y'all no more. I'm done singing. Y'all got me singing up here. Karaoke Fridays now. Not unless y'all singing. <laughs> y'all not going to have me sing, singing while y'all laughing on the other end. Like, <laughs> No, <laughs> not gonna happen. Not tonight. Shoot, boy. It's Friday night, y'all. It's Friday night. So, with that being said, I'm gonna let you lovers get y'all freak on and us others cook and Wait, meant to be? Um, uh, no, I don't think that's the right one. I don't think that's. I don't think that's the right one. I don't, I don't agree with that, Genesis. No, no, Genesis, that's not it. It's sung by a man. What's his name? I think his name is James something. Hold on. No, it's not sung by her. I know you're talking about because I'm looking right at it. That's not it. That's what I said. It is behind time. Oh, I'm sorry, Genesis, you were right. Yeah, Genesis, I'm sorry, you were right. You're right, Genesis, sorry. Yes, because Zach is calling me to bed. Good night, ladies. Good night, Nene. I know, look, y'all. Nene about to get her freak on. Mm. It Look, y'all, it ain't even 11 o'clock. He done called her to bed. Y'all tell me what Nene about to do. It's, it's, it's not even 11 o'clock. On a Friday, he calling her to bed. What I tell y'all? You go ahead and get get the, do your fire and desire, Nene. <laughs> oh y'all, I ain't starting. I ain't starting. I ain't starting tonight. <laughs> look, she go too. Just, just as you looking too, she go. <laughs> We love you, Nene. Good night. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you married. You don't have to do protected. <laughs> so I ain't got to tell you to be safe. <laughs> uh, Miss Broccoli, how to get the book for free? <laughs> Yes, Miss Rebecca, fire and desire. Miss <laughs> Broccoli, those of you who try to get the Michelle Obama book, uh, you go to Amazon 
um, so look for Audible. S see if you can get a free trial for Audible. Once you get the free trial for Audible, you have to download the Audible app. And then you look for the book written by Michelle Obama. That's the best kind of sex with fire and desire. <laughs> Y'all ain't about to take me there. <laughs> Y'all like fire and desire. <laughs> I like running water. <laughs> In the shower. <laughs> Let's take a bath first. <laughs> if you have all the fire and desire you want, let's do that together. That's how you start the fire. You start the fire in the shower. You don't have to pay audible if you have if you have, if you're able to get an audible trial. If you've never had an audible trial, then no, you don't pay nothing for it. Once you download your book, you go back to Amazon and you hit cancel the audible subscription. And what will happen is, is they'll say, well, you have Audible credit up until this date. And then you just use your second Audible credit and then you got the book for free. That's the easiest way to get a book for free. Yes. Amazon.com. Yeah. It's a 60-day free trial. And the Michelle Obama book is up there and she's reading it supposedly. That's what I'm going to try to get mine from. Audible. For free. You got to use those coupons, ladies. Learn how to think how to work around the system because it's already out on Audible, so that's the good thing about it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is Friday night, and I know hubby is probably like, Feed me, feed me now. Yes, Amazon is amazing. So, I want you ladies to look at the crazy coupon lady, see what deals you can. Don't forget to email me those who are okay if you're on Amazon now. Okay, so if you're on Amazon now, let me let me walk you through. I'm gonna walk you through it really quickly. Um, this is for anybody else who needs it. Um, you know, well, Genesis. In the meantime, you know, you can listen to it on Audible and then get a hard copy. So, uh, Miss Broccoli, good night, Genesis. Miss Broccoli, in the search box, put in Audible. Got it? Put in Audible. Let me know when you get there. Do you need me to spell it? Just in case. You got it? It's A-U-D-I, I'm sorry, A-U-D-I-B-L-E. So once it comes up, right, you'll see that like Audible bestseller. So you see where it says Becoming? That's her book. It's available in the Kindle edition and with Audible membership. So you will click on Audible Auto Book, right? And then you have Buy With Membership. And then you can join Audible through there, okay? So you should be able to see, um, you know, the uh, the the button for you to join Audible. Excuse me. Right there underneath it. How dare somebody rate it a one star? You should be shot. So if you want to, you says buy with your membership. You can hit buy with your membership. And it's going to come up. When you click buy with your membership, it's going to come up with a button that says start membership now. And then you can do that. So for right now, um, so the Audible membership is $6.95. But um, you don't have to just hit sign up because you should have a free trial. So, um... The first three months is saying right now the first three months are free. So they're doing, I guess they're doing a 90 day free trial. Because right now it's telling me that for me, because I've already had an Audible membership, that I can get the book for $6.95. But I want it free, so I'll, I'll, I'll fix that one. I'm not gonna do it. 
And you can also then you can also download the Kindle version. And those who are waiting for a hard copy will have to wait. Yes. Y'all, I found the cutest compression stockings. They're, well, they're not stockings. They're socks. But they come up to your knee and they cover your feet. Sorry, guys. Somebody tried to call during my live. Um, so, they tried to call during my live. Um, so, um, like I said, um, I found the cutest compression Socks, they come up to your knees. Socks, they come up to your knees. And um, you, I got a six-pack for $4. But they are so cute. I want to show you guys. Let me see if I can get my leg up that high, though. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Hold on. Let me, let me get my life together over here before I pick my leg up that high. Together over here before I pick my leg up that high. Aren't these cute? They're compression socks, so they keep the circulation going through my legs, but they come up to my knees. Guys, I can't believe I got my leg up that high. I got one of these high tables that sit high off the ground where it has, like, the connecting bench and then, like, the two separate chairs that are really high. Did y'all see that? I got my leg way up to the camera, and y'all on an iPad on a table. Rebecca, look! I didn't get hurt. I was shocked. I was like, "Let me, let me get this leg up." <laughs> I can't believe it got up that high. Woo! Woo! Some acrobatics. I might need to call it an early night. I'm being acrobatic. Aren't they cute? I have hearts, and there's dots, and there's um little like a heartbeat signs, and then um they're all different type, different fun. You know, colors and little designs on them. And they do not look like compression socks, but they're compression socks. I use the Vipin app to get a discount. So, I seen your pics. On from, which pics? Take a flick. What pic? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't post pictures on Amazon. I mean, I mean, Facebook. What picture, Miss Latoya? Y'all see how Miss Latoya called me out? Uh, the full body pics with my boots on. With my cowboy boots on. With my boots. I had on my boots. My cowboy boots. I'm just replying back. Yes. Yes. My when I put the, the sweater the sweater vest in boot season. Cause they thought it was only for people with size two. Yeah, girl. I don't know. I know. I know. I was I was pretty hot and tempting in them photos, wanna? That's all you supposed. Uh, that's all you supposed to see. Rebecca is my face. <laughs> that's because that's why you can only see my face because my table is that tall. That's why, um, that's why you can only see my face. Where did I get those stock, my socks from? I got it from Amazon. I used the Vipin code and got it from Amazon. They were originally $22.99 on Amazon for a pack of six, and I paid $4. I love them. Let me show y'all again. Okay, hold on. Give me a second. Y'all can't be asking for things like this all the time now. Aren't they cute? With the little hearts. Never put your feet on a kitchen table. <laughs> and they got little hearts on them. But they're compression stockings. They're like socks. But they come up to my knees. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have to scrub this table down, y'all, because I will not be at this table unless this table is bleached down. I know it's my own leg, but <laughs> you don't put your feet on kitchen tables. <laughs> I don't play the game in my house. <laughs> I'm about to wash this table. See, I'm going to vip it after you, Eli. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Pack of six. I got so many great colors. So many different designs. They're not even like solid colors. They have designs on them. So they make compression socks look so cute. And they come all the way up to my knee. I'm a little short, so I have extra socks left. But the way they fit, you can't even really tell that they're not long. That um, my legs are shorter than what they than the socks are. But they're so roomy and they're so cute. I I got sick of wearing the brown and the black and the white you know what i'm saying they were not fun i'm young i'm like i'm 34 and i'm young so um i really wanted something fun and when i found these fun wonderful colors i was like yes let me get that one then i saw another coupon and i was like oh yes let me get that one and that one i'll find out for you miss broccoli i'll find out for you so yes i love these socks are wonderful they cover my whole entire foot so my toe was not out like all my other ones they cover my whole entire foot so I don't have to put a second sock on because they're very warm and comfortable, but they also give me that compression so I don't have to put a second sock on like I always do with my other ones. And so, um, I love them. I like looking at them because my, my little leg looks so cute. Okay, <laughs> that's a tall table. I would be on the floor <laughs> with the chair. <laughs> oh my gosh, are you too funny? They are cute for Capri. They are. I, I know, Rebecca. They're so cute for Capri. Like, they look like the teeny bopper socks is when they wear the knee-high socks with the little um the little private school skirts. They look just like that, but they got they're, they're so cute. They got all designs. Uh, Miss Rebecca, I'm 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 a, I'm flexible in some areas. I just admit it. I do uh, cheer dance, um, booty beat, um, hip hop booty, and uh, pole dance for exercise. Because, you know, I really can't stand for long periods and do other stuff. Other exercises like walking and treadmill and so that because of my fibromyalgia. So, I have alternative forms of exercise that I attend classes. So, I am, to be as fat as I am, I'm very limber. Like, my nieces and nephews are surprised that at the age of 34 and being plus size, that I can drop down to a split like the best of them. With no problems. Uh, look... I can do it all. Downward facing dog with one leg up in the air. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm pretty flexible. Now, granted, will I feel uh, comfortable for the rest of the day? No. <laughs> the pain would be terrible by the end. But before I go to my classes, I take my medication. And as soon as my class is over, I take some relief. Because <laughs> if I don't, I'll flare up really bad. But I'm pretty limber. I'm a limber baby. I bet your husband loves every minute of it. He really loves chair dance. Um, you know. Booty beat gets its place. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Booty beat gets its spot. But um, he really loves chair dance because he gets to sit in the chair. And he gets to feel what I'm doing. And so, he likes chair dance. He's like, when I come up with chair dance, he was like, what did you learn today? Like, he's like a kid. Like, I'm like, dude, calm down. I just got out of class. Like, can I get some water? Because, <laughs> like, when I'm done, I'd be like, I, look, I'd be about to pass out going back to my vehicle. <laughs> I'm tell you the story. When you repeat the same moves over and over and over, because you learn, you learn in parts, and then you combine it together at the end. And then when you get it at the end, you, they make we redo the end like three, four times to perfect it. So whenever I do chair dance and I get here, he be like, "What did you learn? How was class? Why are you only excited when chair dance? Like I literally have a pole." In the middle of my living room. And you don't get excited about my pole dance. You get really excited about my chair dance. Why? That's because he can feel what I'm doing. So he likes the little routines and stuff. Yeah, it's fun. It's tiring. I average about two classes a week. So I'll pick my two favorites for that week. And then I just alternate. So I don't do the same 
two classes a week. Like, I'll alternate. <laughs> I'm serious. Because, like, when I do pole, it, you know, inner thigh burns and bruises and falling on my butt a ton of times. <laughs> I, the next class I choose, I try to not pick something that is that strenuous. So, okay, okay, hot. Cheer dance has it. Look, I like cheer dance. Yeah, I like cheer dance. I do. Because it allows me to sit a lot. <laughs> I need to get flexible. I'm so stiff. Oh, Mr. Tweet, don't get me wrong, girl. This back, this back will lock up in the quickness. I have. I was just able to just get my leg up on that table twice. I promise you, I couldn't get my leg up there a third time. Like, if y'all were to say, let's see those socks again. I would kindly say, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't. I got my leg up here twice, and I'm look the second time it was really close. <laughs> like that let you know my leg was getting tired. It's like look now, you can't be tossing and flossing and throwing that leg up out there like you like you ain't like you ain't got back problems. But uh, you definitely you you really learn to stretch. This is what kills me with my fibromyalgia because. I'm in constant pain 24-7, and even though the stretches that we do before we start class, it's supposed to, you know, loosen up your muscles, warm them up, and it causes you to be a little more limber, mm -mm, that don't work for me. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'd be like, oh, my back. <laughs> uh, I mean, well, I tell you, I did tell about that one class, we had cheer dance class. First, the teacher fell. Then I fell, then I fell again, and then I kicked another student in the head. <laughs> then the, st the other student fell, <laughs> and then the teacher fell. So we cut that class quick. We was like, look, today is just not our day. And so we cut that class quick. No, Miss Broccoli. Flexible is not your middle name. None of your business is your middle name. <laughs> we cut that class quick. That class lasted 20 minutes. We were laughing so hard that the aerial class, because it is an aerial class. They use the ribbons and the hula hoop in the sky. There is an aerial class, and the advanced pole dancer class was like, what is going on in there? We were laughing so hard. We was like, we're done. We're done. We done fell, kicked, did all kinds of stuff. We were done. <laughs> when your instructor falls multiple times, you know you're done. Bad enough for a student to fall. When the instructor's falling and I'm kicking folks in the head, I kicked that poor little girl in the head. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so sorry. She was like, no, it's okay. <laughs> she was like, it's my fault. My head was going in the wrong direction. <laughs> I wanted to say you're right, but I couldn't say that because, you know, I just kicked her in the head. So I had to say, I'm sorry, but it really was her fault, <laughs> but I'm sorry. <laughs> I kicked that poor little girl. When I say I kicked her little head hard, <laughs> I kicked her head hard. Y'all, we love, y'all will love my class. What's your class, Miss Broccoli? My body is belt, beat up and broken down from work injuries. I'm very limited restricted from stooping. Oh, I'm strict. I'm, I'm restricted from all that, Miss Rebecca. Uh, my fibromyalgia is terrible. When I say my fibromyalgia is terrible, I stay in pain. But what I do to combat my pain, this is how it works for me when I have to go to class. And I'm pretty sure my doctor would not be happy with what I do. So, I take my pain meds like I'm supposed to. My regular pain meds, which is Trimadol. I don't take a high dose. I have I only have 50 milligrams that I take. So, I take that 150 milligram pill. Well, if you ever had Trimadol and you ever had any severe pain like fibromyalgia and you live in pain like fibromyalgia makes you live in, you would know Trimadol is like taking baby aspirin. So, what I do is I take my one Trimadol and I take four leaves. And the class is an hour long. So, well, 45 minutes long. So, as soon as I'm 45 minutes up, which is an hour before I can get out of the building, because I get my shoes back on, put my pants on, all that stuff. Um, Once I get out of the building in an hour, I already have a leave and water in the car. I take another four leave. 
So within an hour time span, I take eight to leave and one trim it all. That is to not let the pain increase. Like I'm already in pain when I leave. That's to make sure it doesn't increase. And that's how I get I go to my workouts. So, you know. Hello. Oh, you're fine, Miss J- uh, Jones. We appreciate you coming. We ain't gonna be all long. So, Miss Rebecca, it is difficult um, for me. It's not an easy, but you know, I can say it allows me to do some type of exercise. But then when I tell her, "Look, I do exercise. I'm still in pain," and I said, "So this five my hours doesn't go away because you exercise. It doesn't." And then they be like, "Hey, well, you know, the more you exercise," I said, "Look." The only time my pain decreases is when I'm in a hot water pool, which is called a therapy pool. And I've got to stay in it for it to decrease down to like a level two. I stay at level five. And then, but when I come out, I'm like at eight, ten, sometimes 15. Because once I come out of that warm water, the pain kicks in. As long as I sit in that warm water, I'm good. But I can't sit in warm water all day long. So I wish I could though. I want hubby to put a pool in the garage so bad. I don't know if y'all have heard of them little pools, I don't know, therapy pools, where like it, it, it allow you to run underwater, you know, where your top of your head is above water, but, you know, the bottom of your um, body is underwater. And it lets you, like, do single lap. And I, I would love to have one of those in my garages. Thank goodness for Black Sea Oil Long Day. I'll be crying. Yeah. Whew. I can understand. But, uh, yep. Who just it? Oh, the. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna get Genesis. <laughs> I'm gonna get Genesis. Okay, yes, pain, pain, pain. Oh my God, the medication. Every muscle relax on the market. I've had eight hundred. I pull from physical therapy is my enemy. Girl, physical therapy for me is the devil. I hear you about the pool thing. Yes. Yes, I love the pool. Warm water it has to be at a certain temperature for it to work. I cannot just go jumping into your average pool and 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 being good. Mm mm. To certain temperature, so you know that's how it go. But I'm not gonna keep you guys any longer. It's getting late. I got to feed hubby. Yeah, I'm glad it's Friday, y'all. Friday. I got to get up early in the morning. I'm not taking a lift off Miss Broccoli. I won't never sleep. I got to get up in the morning and try to get to the mailbox. Y'all, did y'all know that? I don't know if it's happening in y'all area. But in my area, some of the mail, mail, mail places, mailbox centers, like, um, well, not you, well, I'm talking about United States Postal Service. Are like no longer having like Saturday hours. They're opening up later, like at ten o'clock. Is that happening in y'all area? I'm gonna have to check in the morning and see what time they open, so that I can go to drop these packages off for the two winners. Um, but uh, is anybody else postal service reducing their hours? Did you hear about the Dollar General toy sale? No, what's the deal with that one? They have a lot of toy sales. But see, there's no good toys at Dollar General in my area. So I never, whenever they do the toy sale, I never go for any of it. But whenever they do like the the clothes sale for the kids, I always stock up on PJs. Not going to tell no lie. I stock up on underwear, socks, and PJs. And so that whenever the kids come here, if they don't have clothes... Um, they'll have some wear. Our mail came at night. Miss Broccoli, how about the other day? My mail was delivered at 8 p.m. 8 p.m. I'm like, okay, was our delivery person out sick? Uh, what was going on? 8 p.m. Just so happened, I was expecting a package from Amazon. And I was just about to call Amazon when I heard the truck coming down. I'm like, why do I hear the mail truck this late? 
I enjoy tuning in. My post office truck has been running to us. Yeah, like, I don't know what's going on. So, hopefully, they'll be open tomorrow. If I don't get your package out tomorrow for the winners, I will get it out first thing Monday. I will be there when they open with bells on. Like, ring, ring, ring. It's me. Yeah. So, yeah. All right, guys. I love you all. You all have a wonderful night, a wonderful weekend. I might come on this weekend, depending on how much I miss you guys. I might come on. Because, you know, next week's going to be busy. So, like, videos won't be this long, live won't be this long, because we're going to be busy. Everybody's going to be cooking something for Thanksgiving, um, so they have 50% off. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, I saw that one. Yeah, I did. I did see that, Miss Toya. I did, but I always don't have good toys. So, I like to wait until they do it to the clothes. Then I can get PJs for the kids and underwears and socks and stuff. Miss Broccoli, you have to email me your address. Broccoli, broccoli, broccoli. Email, email, email. All right, guys, don't forget, if you want to be a part of the Secret Santa, please email me your address at diamondsknowledge at gmail.com so that I can add you to the list so that I can match you up with somebody so that you all can receive a lovely, wonderful gift. Um, and if you would just like to send me your email ad I mean your ad your, not your mailing address because you want a Christmas present from me send it you never know what I will send you because I always do things different yeah like y'all like I already know that y'all Miss Nene she's not gonna come back and listen to this live like she's gone to bed so she probably won't come back and listen to the end of this live However, don't tell her I sent her a gift. She doesn't know it. It's a secret between you and me. Can you keep my secret? I sent her a gift. She don't know. She don't have a clue. It's coming on Sunday to her house. The mailman is actually going to show up at her house on Sunday, guys. She don't have a clue. <laughs> See, I just do random. That's why it's important for you to email me your address because I randomly do stuff. I'm a random person. Like, I will randomly send you stuff. So, you might want to just send you your address. I know Broccoli going to tell because you a tattletale. You going you gonna to text her and you going to tell you a tattletale. Everybody said, boo, broccoli. We don't like broccoli. Ooh, it's an ugly vegetable. Oh. <laughs> yes, thank you, guys. I randomly send stuff all the time. Like, if I had your mailing address, I would randomly send people stuff. But I only have a certain number of addresses. So, I randomly send stuff. Like, Miss Latoya, I called her. And said, hey, do you, could you use some extra November PNG coupon inserts? She said yes. I sent them. Um, we did the HelloFresh coupons. Um, we did the Pure One coupons. So I'll be sending those out too. Yeah. So I randomly, like being on part of my channel, things randomly happen. Miss Latoya, you have to email it. That's so sweet. The reason why I say email it, Miss Latoya, because you text me. Yeah, I know. You text me, but because we text so much, it takes me a hot minute to find it. And it's quicker for me to find it through email. Same thing for you, Miss Broccoli. We text so much, it's harder. I'm going to message Nene and message and thank her. Do it in the morning because she's asleep right now. We don't want to wake up Zach. Let Zach rest. Zach has five miles like me, so he needs to rest. All right, guys, I love you all. You all have a wonderful, 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 wonderful night, okay? And I'm looking forward to getting a lot of emails with some people addresses saying Secret Santa. They want to be a part of it. Put Secret Santa in the subject line. If it's for the trivia, put trivia um, drawing in the subject line, okay? All right, guys, I love you all. You all have a wonderful night. Love you all.